so we need what we call bulletproof fabrics. I am an interior designer. The fabric that we use on the window seats, we can use pillows. Have been for probably 25 years. This fabric put on these chairs. Not only interior design, but I have a very active lifestyle. Long time runner, probably about 30 something years. They talk about the runner's high and that's definitely it. Probably about a year and a half ago, I noticed my running style was changing a little bit. When I would start off, my back would hurt, my lower back. But then as I got into it, you know, I'd feel better. And I'd have good days and bad days, which was interesting because I'd never really had a bad day. About a year ago, I went to a neurologist. She said, I don't think you need surgery. Probably in January, I was running one day. I ran about a mile and all of a sudden my leg wouldn't work. Donna's condition uh, was a very unusual one. She got a, a uh, MRI and a CAT scan done at another facility which showed excessive growth of this tumor-like process around many of the supporting structures of the spine. When I saw her, we worked her up appropriately by getting a biopsy of this. And fortunately for her, it was a benign process. However, what that proceeded to do, you can see on the CAT scan, is completely erode many of the bony structures that typically support the spine. Uh, my concern was that if we left this untreated, she would continue to deteriorate to the point where she would be completely unable to function or, or, or be able to live uh, independently. So the treatment for a condition really involved three stages. The first part was to completely remove the tumor-like process that was compressing her spinal nerves and causing the pain she was having. The second part was to reconstruct the portions of the spine that had been completely eroded. And the third part was to stabilize it so that it would uh, provide long-term uh, stabilization. So I think the sofa should be in the solid. And people really thought that I was never going to be what I was before. So I can honestly say I am completely back to normal. My running is not, um, but I'll build up to it. I fully expect that Ms. Cohen will make a complete 100% recovery, and she's well on that way. I think we can attribute that to uh, both our improved surgical techniques and technology, as well as to the improved uh, patient experience during their hospital stay. And it's interesting how many people, when they ask me, how, do, how are you doing? I said, I'm doing great. And they always all have a story to tell about somebody they knew that had back surgery that never quite recovered from it. And I always thought, well, they didn't have the right doctor. The care I had at Shands was fantastic.